world as we know it does not exist without struggle. Our civilization is under constant assault from forces we would once have called the powers of hell. In truth, these forces are far more ancient than Christianity. More ancient than any religion that has left its trace upon our species soul. It is evil incarnate. And it has been working to destroy our highest aspirations. Our faith in love and light since we came into being. But we do not dare name this evil. To do so would be to admit to its presence in our world. To acknowledge that its servants walk the same streets that we walk. And its overlords, depraved, corrupt, and hungry for our flesh and our destruction, are hidden in the empty wastes of our planet, awaiting the day of mankind's execution. Only one power stands between us and universal death. Warrior magicians who have dedicated their lives to our protection. Most of us will never know their names, nor the battlefields where they wage their secret wars, nor will we ever honor their dead. But they are with us, always. Armed, vigilant, and ready to die for another tomorrow. Jericho. They are called Jericho. They know all too well what the enemy is capable of. That before our species perishes, we will be tortured into madness, devoured alive. And they will do all in their power to protect us from such atrocities. If the world exists tomorrow, now you know why. Jericho. ancient city emerged from the sands of time, bringing with it the seed of all evil. Rawlings, Church, Cole, secure the entrance. The rest of you with me. Picking up the signal from the Swiss Guard recon squad? Yeah, but I can't get a lock. It's getting close, but there's lots of interference. That's never a good sign. What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? Stormstriker S69 here with, with Grand Star Legion. What the heck did I just watch? Anyways, welcome to another Stormstriker S69 Spooktoberfest video. The next game I will be playing is called Clive Barker's Jericho. Oh my gosh. This game will not be for the faint of heart. 18 plus only. Warnings now. So, yeah. I will not be voicing throughout the gameplay of this game, so don't get too scared now. 
there will be plenty of jump scares and to go around in this game so yeah um, this will be a world of hell no matter what anyways let's go ahead and start a game shall we see y'all at the end for the outro By the way, you can find Clive Barker's Jericho for PC as well as PS4, oh, PC, PS3, and Xbox 360. Yeah, PC, PS3, and Xbox 360. That's where you can find this game on. So this game is not easy to find to this day as it's not even for sale anymore digitally. So if you ever find this game, you can find it on Amazon or eBay or whatever, you know. Or your local GameStop or wherever you get buy your games physical. Anyways, um, let's go ahead and start the game. Where is this? This is where it all started. This isn't real. It's as real as your soul. Help me. <clears throat> it's three in the morning. And you felt it too. When? Oh, shit. Okay. I'll see you at the airfield. They call us the Jericho Squad. We are the top secret combat arm of the U.S. Army Chaplain's Corps. As far as the government is concerned, we don't exist. Each of us is a specialist in one of the arcane arts. The Army calls what we do covert occult warfare. <laughs> it's just a fancy euphemism for witches with guns. There was a time when the church would have burned people like us as heretics and monsters. Now, we fight their wars for them. Not much of a view, is it? But somewhere down there is the cause of 4,000 years of human conflict. Name any conqueror. Napoleon? Kublai Khan? They've all fought and bled for al -Khali. It may well be the oldest city in human history. It's also ground zero for Operation Vigil. The rest is strictly need to know. And for the moment, you don't. Vigil was my first assignment with the department. Recognize that cheerful fellow beside me? Arnold Leach. Our old friend. This was taken back in 62, before we had any idea what he was capable of. Ritual murders in Baltimore, gas attacks in Sydney, and those poor kids in London. You got it. Anyway, Leech and his so-called Brotherhood of the Dark Rapture have been trying to gain access to al Khali for nearly 20 years. Seems that two days ago, he finally gave up on subtlety. 
Where'd you get these? Remote viewers at Langley got some psychographic images out before Leech shut them down. Okay. We'll run this just like the Glamis breach a few years ago. Cole scans for temporal anomalies? No. No, this isn't the same, not even close. Trust me when I tell you that the team has never faced anything like this before. What's the plan? Infiltrate the dig site and neutralize Leech and his cronies before they can open the breach. Now, Colonel Acklin of the Swiss Guard is providing perimeter security. He'll give us a sit rep once we're on the ground. Wake up, Frank. <sighs> we there yet? God, I hate the fucking desert. Pretend it's the beach. What the hell is that? It's happening again. This is where it all started. Help me. Hold on, this is gonna get rough. Captain, there are no reports of sandstorm activity in this area. This is not a natural phenomenon, sir. This is as close as we get. That wind will snap this bird in two. We'll take it from here. Safe flying. See you at the LZ. You waiting for an invitation, Jericho? Go, go, go! and follow me. Cole, give me a waypoint 100 meters from the edge of the storm and scan for any weak points. The rest of you, stay frosty. Incoming coded transmission, sir. Patch it through. Captain Ross, do you read me? Ross here. Jericho is in country. Lieutenant Colonel Aklin of the Swiss Guard. Welcome to the Rub al Kali. What's the SID rep, Colonel? This is what we know, Captain. The research facility here was attacked two days ago by a force of unknown size aligned with a fringe religious sect called the Brotherhood of the Dark Rancho. The Defenders were overrun, but not before making one last transmission. The facility of our Korea is under attack. Send reinforcements as soon as possible. Hurry, please! We can't hold it off for long! Shortly after this message was received, the sandstorm engulfed the facility and cut off all communication. We have reason to believe the storm itself is impenetrable. That's beautiful. I'll check back with you once we're inside. Jericho out. We having fun yet? Negative. I'm picking up something, Captain. There's a tunnel around here somewhere and there's something else, sir. Let's get a weapons check, people.
fascinating. The mural's Sumerian, but the writing's Aramaic. Ancient taggers? Well, that are art critics. What's it say? <laughs> Help wanted. The gateway to paradise is unlocked with the souls of the innocent and the blood of gods. So, which are we? Well, we're not gods. Speak for yourself. Shit! It was a joke! I think you'll live. City of Alkali. You feeling anything, Jones? No, not exactly. It's more like everything's just sort of empty. I was going to say dead. Cole, do a comm sweep for me. See if you can bring up command. I want to call in a sit rep and see what's happening. Jericho, take cover! U.S. Army, halt! Show me your hands! Easy, guys. They could be friendlies. They're not stopping. Ross, you need to look at this. What you got? I, I don't think they're alive, sir. Permission to fire! Hold fire! Bullshit, man! Look at them! Jesus! Move out. Roger! Is it Christmas already? Cole, how you doing on that sit rep? There's nothing, sir. I've done a full sweep. Other than our own radios, we are completely cut off. We should abort. It's just temporal distortion, nothing we haven't dealt with before. Stick to the plan. Jones, take Alpha and do some recon. Do not engage without backup. Back here in one hour. Omega, let's go. So what is the plan? We find the command center and recover the surveillance data from the attack. Whatever Leech has done here, it's clear he's in over his head. If they open the breach, there's no telling what might come out. Agent Green's in charge of the facility. She can brief us when we find her. Spot. 
How long since you were here last? Captain. Ross? Who's there? Ross? Shh. Listen. We've been expecting you. Over there, look. Don't move! I think it wants us to follow. Everyone stay close. Next time you plan a trip to Wonderland, count me out. Okay, Rawlings? Ice crystals. The ground's frozen. A blood sigil? That's serious magic. It makes sense, doesn't it? If they knew they were under attack, they'd have rites and incantations in place to lock the facility down. Can you unbind it? Sure can. This is one of ours. You might want to step back a bit. You should hurry. I don't know how long before it closes again. You don't want to be halfway through when it does, know what I mean? Rawlings, come with me. Abby, Billy, you two hang back. If that door doesn't open from the inside, I'm gonna need you to let us out. You got it, sir. Neat trick.
What do you guys think of this game so far, huh? Creepy enough for you? Or is it just like, I don't know, Gears of War? <laughs> I mean, the guy I'm playing sounds just like Marcus Phoenix. In fact, it might be the same voice actor. Back to the game, guys. What are we looking for? There's a huge array of paranormal detection and surveillance gear constantly monitoring Al Kali for any sign that the dimensional rift is weakening. We need to find and recover that data so we can determine what Leech has done and hopefully undo it. Let's move along. Muriel! Drop your weapon! Don't you fucking move! Muriel, it's me, Paul! You're one of them! I know it! I said drop the goddamn gun, now! Muriel, I swear it's me, Paul Rawlings. We met in 96. I was your handler in Chechnya, then Sudan. What about Prague? Prague. Uh, Prague, 1999. New Year's Eve at the Hotel Bohemia. We... danced a cold porter tune sung in Czech, then drank ourselves stupid on absinthe. Uh, I'm afraid my memory gets a bit fuzzy after that. Are you hurt? Something terrible's happened. They've already opened the breach. It's already out. What's out? What's she talking about? Operation God Seal. That's why they sent you, isn't it? You've got to stop it, Paul. If you don't, we've lost everything. Everyone in the world is lost. Did you manage to record the event itself? If we can pinpoint the source of the temporal distortion, we can find the breach. Cross, can you read me? I'm here. We got trouble. Alpha needs backup. What's your location? Northwest corner of the dig site. Multiple hostiles. We keep firing, but they just keep coming! Sit tight! We're on our way! Alpha needs help! We can't leave her here. I'm not asking. Abby! Billy! We're moving out! Prostrate myself before the five-faced lord of Parvati, who is adorned with ornaments shining like a jewel. I thought you were a priest. I am a priest. Well, what about Prague? I'm also human.
Alright guys, well, uh, that was interesting, back to the game.
Wait here. Yeah, okay. Move out. Look alive, Jericho! By the grace of God. Ambush! I've got to help Delgado! Target down, sir. Spotted, sir. Jesus, Rawlings! Multiple targets, sir. you to do some extreme data recovery. You up to it? That depends on the level of temporal distortion experienced at the site in relation to the event horizon of the breach itself. If the vortex is strong enough to cause a feedback loop, then theoretically, if the data existed, then it's always existed, sir. I have no idea what you just said. I think I can recover the data, sir. Good enough for me. Wait here. Okay. Advance to waypoint, Alpha. Moving out! Omega team, move up. Roger that. Move up, Alpha. Okay. Omega team, move up. Yep. Alpha team, move forward. I'm going. There's another one. That's a kill. Wait a sec. He's hurt. He's down, sir. I can think of a thousand things I'd rather be doing, and this is not one of them. This isn't human blood, sir. At least not all of it is.
Alright guys, that'll be it for this game. Let me go back to the title. Alright guys, that'll be it for this video and game of Clive Barker's Jericho. Hope you guys enjoyed this game. Uh, this sorta gave me a Gears of War vibe, but in first person view. You know. But, this is sort of a horror game, horror action, sci-fi game. You're literally fighting demons in hell, or coming out of hell anyways. Um, Clive Barker's... Clive Barker is very good on his stuff. So, yeah. Um, this was an interesting game. Hope you guys enjoyed as well. If you did, please remember to click that like button, comment below, share with your friends, add the favorites, and click that subscribe button. All right. And also click that notification bell to know when I upload new videos on Grand Start Legion or my main channel. I am Stormstriker as it's nine, and I will see y'all next time. Thank you.